Today I'm going to talk about the magic square. We have a three by three square here. And the object of this magic square puzzle is to fill up the nine boxes with numbers one through nine, such that when you add the numbers across, you get 15 in any direction. When you add up and down, you get 15. And along the two diagonals, you get 15. Now, there's a certain strategy in doing this problem. And uh, let's, first of all, uh, look at the corners. If you have a number at a corner, it must be involved in three combinations, across, down, and diagonally, to give you nine. And if a number doesn't have three combinations, then it can't be on a corner. The number in the center must be involved in four combinations, diagonally this way, diagonally this way, up and down, and left and right. So um, if you can find a number that can, with two other numbers, add to 15 in, five, in four different ways, then it could be in the center. If it could be in three different ways, it could be in a corner. But if it can only be involved in two different ways, it has to be at the end. So the object is to find uh, the number of combinations. Let's start with 1. 1, 9, and 5 is a combination that adds up to 15. 1, 8, and 6 is a combination that adds up to 15. Now you will see that there are no other combinations, because if you add 1, and 7 together, that's 8. And um, you'd need 7, again, 1, 7, and 7, where you can't repeat the same number. Uh, 1, 6, and 8, you already have. 1, 5, and 9, you already have. 1, 4 is 5. You'd need 10 to get 15. So 1 cannot be here, or here, or here, or here. It can only be here, here here or here. And then if you repeat this with number 2, number 3, number 4, number 5, up through 9, you should find the possibilities of where those numbers can go. So uh, I hope this gives you a good start in trying to do this puzzle. Thank you, and I hope you uh, are able to do the puzzle.